Uh, love from love, hope from hope, and peace from peace. It is time to Google T-Rex blood cells and see the blood cell of the T-Rex in the veins. It's time to Google the videos under my channel to Google entombed animals and to see how hundreds of them have come out of the rocks alive uh, as the Smithsonian Institute verifies. And it is the time to realize that those animals had no air to breathe for like millions of years. Now, this earth was made with great, very great age. First came the uh, Garden of Eden and all the uh, leaves of the trees were as the meat for all a creation. Vegetarian was it. Then the satanic falling of the sons of God came forth and saw the daughters of men were uh, fair and they took them and then came the giants. And according to Gilgamesh, they ate us. They were cannibals. So this world had to have the great flood come to wipe away the gigantism because those were the days when of 2,000 pound sloths. So this world was made with very great age, ancient on uh, day one. Uh, look up Paluxy Alvin uh, uh, Delk uh, fossil uh, and you'll see a uh, uh, triceratops uh, footprint with a mankind footprint, man footprint right on top. Uh, Google uh, 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 giant footsteps in stone and you will see dozens of them all over this world. These are the days when the illusion of Charles Darwin uh, comes clear to see. He even fully recanted his uh, uh, theory of evolution. He regretted that it was like a wildfire that once he uh, let it out, uh, it, it took over and had a mind of its own. But let the dead bury its dead and know that if you Google uh, T-Rex uh, uh, channel under my uh, channel, put Daniel Owsley Marco Polo and you will hear a vivid description of these guys that as mankind used to hunt them for, and sell the meat, uh, expensive gourmet food in the Orient. So there's much more than meets the eye. Uh, science has always said that uh, one inch uh, to grow a stalagmite, stalactite in a uh, uh, a cave takes thousands of years and yet there are uh, three foot columns of them uh, under the Lincoln Memorial only built in 1869. So in this world it's time to realize that uh, there has been a veil of knowledge, understanding, uh, a veil of stupidity over the whole thing. For the truest truth is all the evolution garbage that has been has always been in vain been in vain because the truest truth is that uh, uh, we know now that uh, DNA of a frog only makes a frog DNA of a toad only makes a toad now if you want a fode uh, a frog toad you got to cross them and then it would mix the DNA and you could have a fode or a uh, 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 frode or frog, <laughs> I don't know what you call them when they're mixed, but one thing's for sure that the story is true that you cannot have a fish like all the evolution charts show a fish producing over time a, a frog with legs or a salamander and then the salamander grows hair and then it becomes like a wolverine and then the wolverine keeps on walking along and then it decides to become a woolly mammoth and that kind of BS. So things are not at all as what reality has been. Neither has that been true with religion all man-made religion has been man-made and uh, if you want the truest truth come to this channel where the Lord is removing the veil of love off all peoples of the earth so in this hour love from love and remember that we must turn things in order to see that which is clear before us that history has always been goofing up in regards to our beginnings so in this hour the lord wants to pour out his spirit of love over all people by restoring our understanding of the truest truth of what happened at the garden of eden and before so come to my channel where it's all explained away and it all uh reverberates and uh with harmony 
and goes along with all science that is true.